Hey everyone, today is Thursday, August 9th, and I just wanted to do a video talking a little bit about health, and health specifically in terms of diet. And I have been on this uh, raw vegan diet for about seven months now, and uh, one of the things that I haven't brought up in past videos that I find amazing is that I haven't been sick in seven months. Uh, that was one of the things you know, when you watch these raw vegan videos and these people like advertising uh, things about raw vegan videos, I, they pretty much say everything from, uh, you know, it'll cure baldness um, to it'll make you better at sex to uh, just, uh, anything. Um, you know, it, it cures cancer. It, um, uh, you know, it, it'll, it'll help you regrow legs that you've lost. If you, if you had an arm cut, if you lost an arm in the war, uh, you know, it, it'll, it'll cause it to grow back. I mean, you, just people just say all kinds of stuff. And um, when, when, when I first saw it, I, I didn't expect, you know, crazy things to happen. Um, but but I, I did, I was curious. I, I wanted to know for myself, because uh, I had been thinking about becoming a vegetarian and when I started seeing um, all these videos about raw vegans and, and the way they promoted it, I thought, oh, you know, I, I want to give that a shot. I want to see what it's what it's all about. So, so I did. And the one thing that that I have found to be true above all um, other things is that I have completely er eradicated all forms of sickness from my life. Uh, I have no colds, no flus. I don't get like. Um, I don't get like stuffy noses, I don't get sore throats, I don't have problems with my sinuses anymore. I, I live in Dayton, Ohio, and we get a lot of pollen in the air. Uh, actually, I take that back. I did, I did start sneezing a, a bit this past uh, spring, um, but nothing compared to uh, the, the amount of problems that I had in previous years. You know, I'm, I'm 30 years old right now, I'll be 31 on the 18th. So, I haven't had any of the problems that I've had in previous years since trying out this raw vegan diet. And I had started it, and I haven't even really done it 100%. I've gone back and forth at times eating uh, cooked rice, um, potatoes, sweet potatoes, uh, steamed vegetables, and uh, for the last few months I've been trying to do this 100%, and there's a couple times that uh, we've been out and about, I, I play music as part of my income and sometimes I'm in specific locations where there aren't, aren't a lot of food and I don't necessarily have the option to bring food along with me um, but uh, usually there's always a vegan option even if it's not a, a raw food option and generally I can get a low fat um, meal option as well but uh, I, I just wanted to really bring out the fact that that as a, as a result of the you know high carb fairly low fat. Um, I, I actually, a lot of people that do like the 80-10-10 diet, I've noticed do like 90, that like 90% of their calories come from carbs and then uh, like 5% from fruit, or 5% uh, from fat and 5% from uh, proteins. But I, I actually try to keep my fats around 10%, which isn't difficult to do at all. A little bit of fat goes, goes a long way. Um, but uh, I guess the highlight of this video is that I just wanted to share that it was my personal experience that in, in a lot of the areas that people advertise as being raw vegans is for me has been true that I, I actually have not been sick I've, I've gotten rid of all forms of sickness and uh, my health wasn't bad prior to doing this but my health has I have seen an, a dramatic improvement in it since then so that's my experience. If uh, you have experiences, whether they be positive or negative, on raw vegan diets, I'd love to hear about them. You can leave them in the comment section below, or um, and remember to subscribe. And if you like the video, then uh, please click like. Thanks.